today's guest is uh, Mrs. Star N N. So I just uh, met on Clubhouse. How are you doing? I'm doing good. How are you doing? Uh, I'm very good. Thank you very much. Oh, you're making a podcast? Yeah, I'm making a podcast. On which uh, platform? Apple Podcasts, Spotify, and Amazon Music, and so on. Oh, that's nice. And、um, what's about? What's your、uh, your podcast is about? About internationally architecture and music and culture things and so on. Oh, that's cool. Where are you located at the moment? Well, you know,、um, after using Clubhouse, I was like trying to be unknown, so I don't、mm-hmm. want to tell. Where okay,、I'm、very、going. good. No problem. No problem. Unknown is so nice and.、Uh, Yes, but yeah, yeah, I yeah. can I can tell about myself. Like I just graduated from、oh. university. Yeah, from University of Pharmacy. Pharmacy.、Um, mm. Yes, I'm a fresh pharmacist. So, but I'm, <laughs> but I'm not working right now. So because it's really hard, you know, to start working after because you're a fresh graduate. Mm-hmm. Graduations. Mm-hmm. And、uh, I just applied for the. There is an internship, like training,、mm. but there is a long list. I have to wait until my time. Then I can start my training. After、oh. that, yes, it's a long waiting. And after that, they will have there will be an exam that、oh. that comes from the Ministry of Health. And after、mm-hmm. I pass the exam, then I can search for the job,、mm-hmm. and then I can、uh, working as a pharmacist. But right now I'm not working.、Mm-hmm. But so, you know what?、Uh, mm-hmm. I I, I also、know. start my own podcast like、uh, two months ago, or maybe one month ago. Yeah. Ah, then I remember you about.、Uh, so you wanna make some podcast yourself and.、Uh, mm-hmm. <laughs> nice. Yeah. So which yeah yeah, yeah they're talking about the pharmacy things, the knowledge of the pharmacy for sharing. How which、uh, medicine will good for the for stomach and the headache and so on? Yes, it's about medications,、oh. but also sometimes I do talk about、uh, like vitamins or minerals. Hmm. Yeah, but I only have three episodes because、nice. it's just、uh, new. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I can I put、do. it on my podcast and uh, uh, the the link for your podcast. That would be for you know exchange the client audience and so on. Yeah, that would be nice. Okay, yeah, take your time. Yeah, yeah no problem. I had、uh, so many hours of working on、uh, for my sculpture. It's too much. I think I need、uh, some uh, there's a、uh, uh, topics to do this. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But I want to ask you about your live streaming. Does your show、uh, reach、nice. like one one millions? One、um, millions view? No, no, no. It's just. <laughs> no. But yesterday I decided to start live streaming. The reason is、um, the Twitter and Instagram and YouTube is.、Uh, Is I use for real name, real family name, on a first name and so on. But、uh, if I wanna something to do different, so I use some different app with anonymous. I、uh, for Clubhouse, I just use a voice. The voice is kind of like、uh, anonymous. But、uh, if I do the live streaming with、uh, visualize, then it's、uh, it's me. So I try to do this. Yeah, yesterday I decided. I see. So, like, just yesterday you you start doing a live streaming on Instagram, right? Yesterday I decided to do YouTube live. Oh, that's It, cool. Well,、hmm. good luck in in your YouTube lives. Yeah, But, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah.、Mm-hmm. Do you do it in English or in、uh, Japanese? Ah,、um, both of that. So someone someone commented. Of in Japanese, then I can say Japanese answer. Then someone ask me, 
some English message, then I respond to do with English. Oh, you know, but it's better to have it in English. So like everyone <laughs> could understand you. <laughs> yeah. yeah, of course, of course. I will translate in English. Yeah, sure. Yes. And then you will have more audience. Because mm. everyone knows English, but not everyone does know <laughs> Japanese. <laughs> sure. Yeah, I know. So then this podcast is really good. Yesterday, before yesterday, they are coming from, from the Houston. He was in South Korea several years. And one guy is from New York. He talking about uh, he came from the uh, Rwanda, I guess, when he was 10 years ago, uh, 10 years old. Then he came to New York and he working the, the, in New York. So it was so fun. Oh, that's cool. Hmm. So then I, then I found you today. So Jan, then I ask you making a podcast with me. And uh, so, so can you share something interesting for your podcast? For example, like the vitamins, what, which fruit is good for vitamins and so on? You mean here right now? You say yeah. uh, to share with you what cast like. You mean this uh, replays on Clubhouse or which uh, what cast, uh, podcast you're, you're talking about? Uh, uh, you know, this Clubhouse can be easy to recording, you know? with a high quality voice then I can download it this uh, voice data then I can put it on the just to edit it with my app then I can upload it for for the Apple podcast and so on oh and how we can do that oh I know I never know that people can actually have a record from Clubhouse hmm <laughs> It's uh, quite uh, far away from the introduce, uh, introduction, but in, but um, at, the, at the beginning you have to create a house yourself, or you can join some club, some house. Then, when you wanna open your rooms, you just uh, swipe in the right side, and then the, then they can they can show the many kind of like kind house on the top then you can choose wh whatever you want then you can start ha rooms with house then the after the recording then you can see you can go to the house page then they have some many list the one of that they could say um, listening replays and so on then you can tap on three dot then there are the rest on the download data and so on. Yeah, got it? Yes, I get it now. Go, okay, okay, okay. So, but, uh, mm -hmm. it's the voice like uh, from this record will be, you know, having a good quality. Is the voice mm -hmm. clear to add to any mm -hmm. sure. other platforms or podcast? Mm, yeah, I use the. Uh, uh, this uh, condenser mic with a mixer then the voice is much much better than only talking on the phone so okay i get it mm -hmm. so <laughs> which kind of topics you want to share for my art podcast for example i listening uh, i found uh, today some university found uh, it was uh, south part of Japan they have a uh, special vitamin orange are uh, found it or created this one is good for the tree flowers the beans of tree flowers uh, coming through the na nose and this the action <laughs> like this so <laughs> You, uh, okay. you... what's the name of the vitamin you can find it in orange right so i guess maybe you're talking about vitamin c because mm -hmm. you can find this kind of vitamin and in, in fruit like acid fruit like orange or lemon uh -huh. 
Huh? And vitamin C is really good for your health because they can improve your immunity. And you know, also people use it for like for beauty because they have antioxidant effect, like uh, anti-aging. Uh, yes. Anti-aging. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. So there is different uh, forms of vitamin C. They can you can have it as a tablet or you can have it as a topical, which like apply in your skin to giving you the like the health benefit of skin to have a natural skin uh-huh. because of the effect of antioxidant uh, antioxidant i meant but also they have immunity so vitamin c it's good uh, against some viruses like flu or influenza even as you know in the time back of coronavirus pe- people keep using kept using uh, vitamin c because of the immunity whenever you have like virus it's because of your immunity is uh, weak so you have to find or to search for some um you know vitamins or nu- nutrition that can improve your skin your immunity and can be like a defense mechanism against strange organism like virus or bacteria so vitamin c will be the great one to do that it's like a defense mechanism for your body oh that's uh that's so good defense okay i search on google and translate is pollen pollen p-o-l-l-e-n high fever no, you know this. Oh, did you say pollen? Pollen. 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 Uh, I don't know what what's that. Uh, pollen. Pollen allergy. 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 Oh, you're you're talking about pollen allergy. Yeah, you know, you know this. It's a kind of allergy that uh, comes from you know some plant. Some people have allergy from trees or plants that have these pollens. That it's like. You can say it's just like a seed, you know, the seed, seed mm-hmm. in, yeah, in the plant or the flower that gives the pollen in the air. So some people who uh, have like genetically allergy of this kind of like trees and plants. Mm-hmm. So it's called pollen allergy. It's more like having, it's, uh, it's different from from each individuals, but it's more like you have a problem with your respiratory tract and you have difficult breathing or sometimes it's more like asthma. You know asthma? Uh, how to spell it? Uh. A- A-S-M. You know, asthma, it's a condition like some people have a, uh, difficult breathing and Mm, okay, okay. Asthma. I found it. It's a zensoku. Yeah, yeah, in Japanese, zensoku. Okay. Mm-hmm. What uh, What do you call it in Japanese? Zensoku. It's that Japanese asthma is called like that. Oh, okay. okay. So, yeah, it's kind of allergy that has mm-hmm. an uh, effect in your respiratory tract mm-hmm. and uh, its effect in your, in your breathing. Mostly like having a difficult breathing and cough. That's, you know, the yeah. symptoms and the sign of asthma. So when you have a pollen allergy, it's more like uh, it's one of the respiratory tract conditions like asthma. Mm-hmm. And this more, it's like genetically. Not mm-hmm. everyone can have it. I mean, yeah, there is like some, some people, yeah. They, they do not have it like well when they grow when they grow up like as a child like genetically but after grow up for some external factors or because of the environment there is different factors can affect on that and then you will have this allergy which is called pollen pollen allergy yeah this morning i i got the news from this pollen allergy uh protection with the uh, orange you just read about pollen allergy with the, mm-hmm. that uh, orange can right yeah right right mm-hmm. great yeah yes 
well orange because have a different vitamins it's not just uh, vitamin c but uh, mainly i say vitamin c because it's a great uh, source for t uh, like nutrition to improve your immunity mm -hmm. it's a vitamin c but also you can have zinc you know this uh yes Z E. that's a uh, minerals it's also famous as like giving improving your immunity and work as a defense mechanism against any strange uh, uh any strange organism like virus or bacteria or whatever that's organisms that enter your body it's like mm. a defense mechanism fight strange uh, mm. organisms that enter your body so but how ye... how can we use this knowledge for for my life for our life uh, is that uh, the way of how to get the vitamin c in a good way uh, you can just eat the orange, you know, maybe you have some many medicines and so on, or... Well, if you, what, what? yeah, if you're looking for vitamin C, you mm -hmm. can find it in in uh, different nutritions, as you say, like in orange or lemon or carrot, they all mm -hmm. have in a vi mm -hmm. source, they all count as have a source of vitamin C, but if mm -hmm. you looking for the tablet also you can have it from the pharmacy there is a vitamin c tablet mm -hmm. you can have it like th there is a different uh, dose of vitamin c like there is 100 i mean 1000 mm -hmm. milligram of vitamin c and also there is a 500 so mm -hmm. you can have it as a daily tablet just mm. uh, for protection and also just to improve your immunity so you take you know, the, the tablet uh, vitamin C all every day or you not? Well, I do have vitamin C, but I don't take it like daily, you know, mm -hmm. but I'm more like focusing on how to, to have it from natural resource, mm. like from uh, vegetables, from uh, fruits, you can mm -hmm. find vitamin C in those. So you said uh, orange lemon and carrot is it three as the uh, most yes uh, and there's also vegetables i, I can't like yeah mm -hmm. some of vegetables have in the uh, source of vitamin c but right now i can't uh, remember mm -hmm. it's no a long problem. time you know from studying and everything so <laughs> a lot yes. of our study have been like forgot forget yeah, yeah. but you know uh, I also like two days ago I read about peppermint do you know peppermint mm -hmm. peppermint yeah tea like yeah. maybe tea or some uh, yes some... tea yeah exactly mm -hmm. it's uh, they say they have been a really good uh, having effect it's called anti-inflammations so it's mm -hmm. good for different inflammation and also good for people who has different allergy just like oh. the one you just mentioned like pollen allergy or mm -hmm. asthma mm -hmm. or any different kind of allergy or infection in your respiratory tract you can mm. use uh, this uh, mint tea it's mm. good for that yeah thank you very much for talking today it was so fun we are just talking about uh, vitamin c and asthma on foreign allergic and so on maybe next time we can share more 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 and more yeah thank yes, you so much so yes and thank you for having me maybe next time i will be ready because like, yeah me too, I, me didn't, too. I didn't give any like uh, uh a lot of information but yeah thank you for having me today mm -hmm. yeah for listeners do you want to say so for your for my listeners do you want to say something for the in the end yes well thank you guys for listening and um, I hope you guys join my podcast. It's new, but uh, with time will be uh, good. And also, it's not just for medical students because uh, if you have any interest about medications, but also vitamins or minerals, this podcast will be good for you to discover new knowledge. So, yeah. Oh, great. Thank you so much, Stan. Um, so see you next time. See you, everyone. Bye. Okay, bye.